Hey, Visanta here. So last night we did very hard EX Erica and we cleared it without an Arcanine. So I just want to show you guys the VOD and we can kind of go over it and whatnot. And we're just going to wing it. And later we'll also do a Monchamp carry with, the, with the EX Erica as well. So let's get into this. I'm running Infernape, Monchamp, and Lucario. Trainer A is running Infernape, Lucara, and Superior. Erase is running Lycanroc, Lucaro, and Infernape. And so let's just get in there and watch this. And I'll just talk as I go, yeah? So the first thing we do is we're just gonna buff. All, all three of us is gonna buff. So we can get like, we can go massive attack, ham. And then we want to target one of the Roserate, in this case, the left side. We're using Fire Punch because it is more accurate. And it only costs two bars, so you can do a few more attacks. And build up that uni bar. But unfortunately, Lycanroc didn't attack in time, so we did didn't get we didn't get Unity going and rolling here. But this this second turn this second turns of attacks, we're able to get that Unity attack, so a chain has been established. And the so, okay, now we have this. We can still keep hamming on that Roserade, making sure it's killed. And once it's killed, we're going to aim for that other Roserade. Oh, that like around dead. But, you know, spoiler, we did clear it. So, <laughs> it's all fine and dandy. So, the like around pretty much took the aggro uh, because of the, the aggro, whatever, the bulk stack thing. <laughs> I actually hit the like rock, but overkill. So, we switched targets to Roserades. He's sending Lucario, so he's saving his Infernape for last for that Vile Plume, which is fine. So that Lucario will aim for the Lycan Rock. Remember to kill all the adds first. So the two Infernapes are still gonna keep whamming down. Whamming down the Rosary, and Lucario will try to, you know, slowly weaken that Lycan Rock. And we get that Unity, because, you know, we're getting that bar. We'll get at this, and. I mean, he didn't use Infernape during that blast and switch back, but that's fine. He probably have some buffs I probably missed. Oh yeah, he has some buffs. So he's still aiming for that Lycan Rock. We're still aiming for that Roserade. A Toxic incoming. I think I got lucky with that Toxic. I mean, it didn't matter anyways. I was going to sack Infernape. Or I, maybe I wasn't going to sack Infernape, but... I got lucky there with that, with that Toxic. It failed. Oh, I tried to switch, but that didn't work. So, okay. I guess I'm tanking it with Infernape. So, we're going to keep hamming down that Roserade. Building, I'm trying to build that Unity Bar, so I'm just keep attacking. And no point in buffing, because the Sync move is coming up. Boom, boom, boom. A big animation sequence activated. Yeah. Shadow Dance. My Infernape lived. Uh, I'm not sure exactly if any other people lived. Yeah, okay. The car is dead. I, I'm living on, on, on like, more than a sliver, but, like, like bars. Alright, I, I think I wasn't able to switch, so I didn't switch yet. So I'm going to keep hitting the Lycan Rock. Build up that unity, that chain, get that chain going. All right, I think I'm able. Oh, no, I still can switch. Okay. <laughs> I guess it's time to buff, but you know I was dead anyway. So we we switch. I mean, I put use the Fernape to do the Uni attack later, but it's all fine. So in this case, I use Hoo Ha, right? I buff my special defense. So the important part here is the special defense. Keep note. So he did a sync move, and it's like, oh shoot, Lucaro's gonna die. I better do my sync move. Take that, take that aggro. Because if you do a sync move, you get the aggro. Alright, he got the sync move. And then, I mean, he got the aggro. And then now I get the aggro. Fun times, fun times. <laughs> Alright, now I got the aggro. And I quickly hoo ha so I can get that special defense. And luckily, I got mine just before the sludge bomb. Which helps. I think if I didn't get those two hoo ha's out, those special defense plus four, I don't think I would have lit the sludge bomb. The good thing I did. I got lucky, or maybe not lucky. Quick reflex, I don't know. 
So now I live, so I tank that. So I'm going to keep unleashing cross chop. Keep bringing that unibar, sacrificing my Machamp pretty much. Get as much damage as I can, save the car for last, because like, I have buffs on, you know, Machamp. No point. No point in switching. And then he, he saved, he raised save his Infernape for last, so he can keep spamming and whacking. And Lucario is still alive, so we at least still get to do some damage here. With the Mega Lucario, right? Alright, I have no more bars, so I'm, I'm just gonna die hit. And then, there's no- I'm just doing that just so I can get my sync move ready. I mean, I was, I was gonna, get, I'm gonna get killed anyways, because freaking Sludge Bomb is coming at my face. <laughs> Alright, so now, now I got Lucario. I'm gonna- I'm just gonna buff myself since the target is no longer on me. Get ready to whammy on the Vileplume. Alright, I, I it, yeah, he's able to get a sync move in, so we, we, he was he's he got he was able to get a sync move in with an infernate, so that's good. All right, it's the vibe plume is like this much left. All right, I got my attack buffs. I'm going for it because my my bar is ready. I'm gonna just keep whamming down. Oh, so close with that Lucario though, so close. Her name's gone. He did a sync move. Good enough. And like, oh, I'm third news point. I was like, I got this, man. My car is gonna kick, kill it off. And there we have it. No Arcanine clear. Poison that like in rock. And this is very hard. Very hard. Ex Erica. And now, and now that we're going to this, let's talk about the Monchamp carry. It was pretty. It was pretty epic that I just want to show it, and because Monchamp is my favorite Pokemon. So, we're gonna get to that. Alright, for this match, I am running Infernape, Monchamp, Lucario, same as the other one. Trainer A is running Infernape, Lucario, and Superior. And Nikki Z is running Arcanine, Infernape, and Lucario. So this one has Arcanine, but I just want to show you this for the Monchamp, right? So, I'm going for a buff. I think the left Infernape forgot to buff, so that's kind of weird, but... I was like, wait a minute. And then the Arcanine and the two Infernape just went for the attack to build up that Unity chain and get that rolling. Their Unity bonus is activated. So now a super effective attack will do more damage as well. And we're just going to keep whamming on the Rosary on the left. And then after we finish that, we're going to move to the right. So we can keep hitting it to build up that Unity bait, the gauge. And of course, the Vileplume doesn't have Sync move buff on that. So... Her name totally lived that. Just fine and dandy. Don't worry about the attacks in the beginning. Just, just focus fire on one of the Roserades. And of course, the Roserades aim to toxic. But we have that poison resistant wall, right? Alright, I think this one triggers a unity attack. Just in time for the Lycan Rock to spawn. Or was this one? This one, okay. But the Lycanroc was there, so good thing. Now the Union Tower will at least chip off that, that Lycanroc instead of just killing on that sliver hand hanging HP of a Roserade. Alright, we have three Fire Pokemon, so Fire Unity Attack. Fire in the hole. Alright, so we chip some, some of that, and we're still going to keep targeting that Roserade. Make sure we take that out. I mean, I think it's going to Toxic before we can kill it anyways. Yeah, we couldn't build the, the Unity because the, the Infernape on the left went for a, a buff instead. Arcanite is pretty tanky compared to Infernape, so it did, it's tanked it just fine. Alright, so we activate the Unity. It's gonna Toxic. It's gonna Toxic the left Infernape, unfortunately. Okay, I'm, try I'm trying to spam Fire Punch. And I think at this moment, I was like, oh shoot, I should switch to Monchamp to tank. Because at this, at this time, I was thinking, wait a minute, I need to save my Infernape to fight the Vile Plume. But of course, spoiler, uh, the Monchamp ended up doing quite a bit of damage with crits. Alright, so we did get rid of both of Rosary right before the Sync move, so that's that's cool. So, because I'm going to sacrifice my my Infernape, and here is the Sync move super special activated sequence. Alright, my Infernape is gone. That Infernape is gone. Arcanine is still alive. And here 
It's no Monchamp. I couldn't switch, so sacrificing that, bring out my Monchamp. I'm gonna go for Hoo-Haas. Try to get that attack up, and, and of course, I freaking flinched. So, I have nothing to do but buff. So I think after the, the second Hua, yeah, I have enough for a sync move. So that should at least clear my flinch. So I was like, uh, okay, I, I want to get rid of the Lycan Rock. Gotta get rid of it. Infernape did the sync move. I'm going to take that aggro away. And hopefully Lucario took a sync move, did a sync move and took the aggro away from me. Yeah, that should happen because, you know, I cleared the Monchamp. Otherwise, I, I would, Monchamp would totally faint. That, with the... With the double hoo -ha's, the sync move knocked out the Lycan Rock with like 70% HP. And I'm gonna try to cross chop the Lycan Rock. I feel like the Fernape should totally gang on the Lycan Rock, but that, that's fine. We have Lucario in the play. And I think, I don't know why Lucario freaking sync moved the Vile Bloom, probably a misclick or mistarget or something. But it should have aimed for the Lycan Rock. Well, anyway, either way, that took the aggro away from me, which was super nice. And I'm out of I'm out of move gauge bars, so I just tire hit. And then I was like, oh energize coming up. Oh yeah, with that with that superior. Gotta have the superior so I can unleash all those cross chops through the Lycanroc space. Freaking 1.6k damage because of full uha buffs. And it, I think it crit because of the dire hit. Alright, so I'm gonna keep doing cross chop until I run out of move gauges. And then I'm just gonna die hit, might as well buff myself up. And good thing Superior is still there with that art aggro. So at least took that sludge bomb be right before I switched to Infernape. So we got some more hits in with the Fire Blast. But the special attack was right before the Fire Blast, so it was super nice. Alright, so we got the Unity going. And here comes the Trash Out, freaking 986 damage! Unity activated with freaking multicolors, <laughs> grass, fighting, and fire. We did so much. It's 800s, 900s with the, with the double hoo-ha crits. Just because Monchan was able to live long enough. And I got a crit strike. You see that crit strike on that? So I got a critical on that. So that, that helped out quite a bit too as well. Sludge Bomb's gonna take out that Infernape unfortunately. And I got Energized so I can cross up some more. Bye bye Infernape. Do all these, all these 800s because of crits. Alright, I think the capturing the video itself is a bit laggy there. Alright. Look at those 800 crits. So pretty much all those 800 crits sort of whittle down the Vile Plume. And I, I wanted to get that sync move ready, so I just karate chopped. Oh man, another sync move ready. Here comes the Demolition. Monchamp carry with over... What? The... Monchamp would have like so many punches in a second, right? So max train demanding. I was so excited. I was like, oh my god, Monchamp carry. But yeah, so that, that's pretty much it for this video. Just fighting very hard EX Erica. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to hang out live, there's my Twitch, this Twitch down below. And you can feel free to join my Discord. And with that, thanks for tuning in and later days.